In this lesson, we'll be drawing a set of isometric stairs, and we'll add some dimensions. We'll begin by using the T-square and drawing a horizontal baseline. Then we'll use the triangle and draw a vertical height line. Where these lines intersect, we'll draw a 30 degree line to the left and a 30 degree line to the right. Now we'll determine the height of each step, or the rise. For this exercise, we'll do four steps, each at one foot. On the vertical height line, I'll put a dash at the four foot, the three, the two, and the one. This is all drawn in half inch scale. Now I'll determine the depth of the stair unit. In this case, it'll be six feet. Now I'll use my T-square and my triangle, and I'll draw a vertical line at the six foot mark. Next, take your 30 degree triangle and draw a 30 degree line at each one foot increment. Remember that your initial lines or plotting lines are done lightly. We can go back in and verify the shape later. Next, we'll determine the width of the staircase. In this case, it'll be six feet. A shortcut is to transfer the measurement over from one side using your T-square, putting a dash over to the other. That way you don't have to measure it. Now we'll take the T-square and triangle and draw a vertical line. Now we'll determine the depth of each step, or the tread. For this exercise, we'll do four steps. Each step is one foot six. I'll measure one foot six, slide the scale ruler over, mark another one foot six, slide it over again, and mark one foot six. Now, wherever those dashes are, we'll take the T-square, the triangle, and we'll add some vertical lines to map out each step. Now I'll use my T-square and triangle, and I'll draw 30 degree lines to the right at each corner. I'll just run these lines long for now. Now we'll map out the stairs on the other side. We'll draw a 30 degree line at the corner to the left. Draw a vertical, back to a 30 degree, a vertical, and so on. Now we can go back and verify the shape of the object by darkening the lines. Now we'll add some graphic shading by drawing vertical lines on the face of each stair.
All right, let's add some dimensions. We'll add five measurements to this drawing. To begin, we'll lightly draw in some extension lines and some dimension lines. I'll also add some guidelines for my dimensions. Now I'll add the dimensions. The width of the stair unit is 6 feet. The depth is also 6 feet. The height is 4 feet. The height of the steps, or the rise, is 1 foot. And the depth of the tread is 1 foot 6 inches. Now I'll go back in and verify the extension lines and the dimension lines. Here you'll notice I've added my dimension lines on the outside of the extension lines because there's not enough room on the inside. Now I'll go back in and add my arrows. Your exercise is to draw this stair unit in half inch scale. Include a border and a title block. You'll find a copy of this handout in Blackboard after this video.